Hi everyone, you're welcome to Social Peace Channel once again. The right place to get just the right dose for your social challenges. Here on Social Peace Channel, I remain your chief host, Great Shin Wonder. The topic at the moment is communicate it to others. In life, there are many things that people are not comfortable with, but they are not willing to share it out to the other person. Let's say we are friends or brothers and sisters and there's something that I do and you don't like it. But sometimes people don't tend to communicate these things that they don't like about the other person and they just choose to bear grudge about those things without the other person knowing. So if I offend you as a friend, what do you do? Do you just keep it to yourself and continue to nurse and bear that grudge over time or you walk up to me and then you air your opinion and your feelings about that thing. This is how so many people have caged themselves and they put the other person in the blind spot also. Why? Because for the person that has done that to you, it's possible he did not even see any wrong in what he has done. So, why keep that plight in your heart without letting the other person know? It might be that it is your dad that has done something that is wrong. You can look for the most polite manner to relate it to him. It could be the boss in the office. It could be your younger brother or your younger sister. It could be your colleague. It could be your friend. This issue of not opening up on some of the, the hurt that we suffer in the hands of other people by their speeches or actions have kept us in the dark and also blinded other people from the fact that some of the things that they do, other people are not comfortable with them. So, you are that person, you are not seeing a grudge against somebody for what he or she has done, but you have not aired it out. How do you want that person to make amends? How do you want that person to come out of that error of hurting other people? Because the same way it hurts you, it's possible it's doing it to other people and you don't even know. So, the best way is to communicate some of the hurt feelings that we suffer from the actions and inactions of other people. Don't keep it to yourself. Communicate it to others. Let them know that this is what you feel concerning what they have said or what they have done. This way, you would have brought yourself to limelight and you would have made people to understand how to work with you in future times. And then for the people who you are communicating to, they will also see that this thing that they have done is wrong and you would help them to desist from it. To keep grudge is not the way to go. I've said it in my video past times that we don't have to keep grudge against any person because that grudge will be a grudge against life and it will limit us in so many ways. So, communicate it to others. Don't keep those hurtful feelings to yourself alone. This is my take. If this is the first video you're watching on my channel, 
like you to subscribe, like my videos, and also share them so that we can bring this information to people who might be needing them out there. Here on Social Peace Channel, I remain your chief host, Great in Wonder. Thanks for coming. Bye.